I feel like we've been walking around here for hours. We should have been back with the rest of the group by now. Do you know where we're supposed to go? Yeah, well, why would I know? You're the one that said you knew the way. We have to get back to the campsite soon. It's getting dark and it's gonna be cold at night time. The others are probably gonna start to worry. <sighs> we should have gone with the others when we left the lake. We're never gonna find our way back now. And everything looks so different now that it's dark. I mean, well, you know what they say when you're lost, you're supposed to stay in one place, right? So I guess if we have no idea where we're going, we have to just wait here and hopefully the others will find us soon, right? We don't want to keep walking and just get further and further away from them. I'm sure in a little while they'll realize we're missing and then ah, they'll come and look for us and bring the torches and <laughs> come to our rescue. I'm never gonna forgive you for this, you know that, right? Mm, come on. It looks kind of comfy over here by this tree. It's soft and mossy, at least. Ah, oh. oh, it's cold. And the sun's setting already. I guess it's happening earlier now during the day, isn't it? The summer's almost over. No, oh. it's getting cold, too. I probably should have brought a jacket with me, but... Well, it's not like I was planning on you getting us lost, was I? <sighs> yeah, okay, well... I don't know the way either. I thought you did, so I just followed you. I mean, we can't be that far from the campsite, right? <sighs> the others will find us soon. Gosh, <laughs> you really forget how much warmth the sun brings. Oh, gosh. Mm, I wish I had a nice warm rock to spread out on. Oh, I would give anything to sunbathe right now. Mm. I guess I'm still in my swimwear, too. I guess we... Really didn't plan very well for this. We probably should have gotten changed before we started walking to the campsite. Because now I'm wet and freezing cold and the sun's going down. <laughs> what? Uh, no. I can't cuddle you and use you for warmth? Are you kidding? Uh, I, why would I want to do that? Come on, I'm not that desperate. Oh. Mm. Okay, well, maybe I am getting really cold, but... Fine. I guess you being a human does come in handy sometimes. Fine, all right, I'll do it. We can cuddle if you really want to. But don't you tell anyone about this, okay? I don't want them thinking that, like, there's something between us or something. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm 
not embarrassed. Why would I be embarrassed? I can cuddle you if I want. Doesn't mean anything. It's not like I like you or anything. What? Just stop looking at me like that. Just come here and get closer to me. You know, it's not anything special. We're just gonna cuddle together for warmth, for survival. After all, it's not easy being a reptile out here, especially when the sun goes down. I get cold really easily. And, well, <laughs> it makes me sleepy, but I promise I'm not, I'm not cuddling you because I like you or anything, okay? I just want to make that clear. <laughs> Fine, just lift up your arm. Let me snuggle into you. How cuddle into your chest is probably where it's warmest. Go on, move. Uh, 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 hey, stop looking at me like that. All right, well, you are really warm, okay? I'll give you that. But this doesn't mean anything. It's just cuddles, okay? Uh, how do you get so warm anyway? Uh, you humans are so weird. You don't have to warm yourselves up in the sun at all. I can't imagine what it's like being warm-blooded. <laughs> it's so strange to think about. <sighs> you better not tell anyone about this, okay? I don't. I don't want anyone to get the wrong idea. This is just completely. Mm, totally, just for survival. Okay? Just... Uh, it doesn't mean anything. Mm. Uh, I am not getting defensive. What are you talking about? Well, I'm saying it so much because it's true. I don't like you, and this is just, this doesn't mean anything. It doesn't matter how warm and cuddly you are, okay? It's just that... It's nothing, okay? Just forget it. It doesn't mean anything. Besides... <laughs> It's not like you would like someone like me anyway. It's not like I've ever been very nice to you. Uh, well, I mean, I don't know. I just, I don't know what I feel, okay? It's just, when we met, you joined our friend group, I guess. I don't know. I... I do like you. I mean, you're a really great guy and everything, but... I don't know, all the other girls were kind of flirting with you and stuff, and... I don't know. I guess... I figured they're all so much cuter than me and prettier than me and I figured I guess I never thought I 
I never thought I had a chance with you. So, I guess maybe it was easier to just bully you a bit and be harsh towards you and, and put up defenses rather than letting you know how I felt. And not that I, like I'm not obsessed with you or anything, I'm just, I don't know, I, I think you're a really nice guy, okay? But that, that doesn't mean anything, like, uh, I know you probably are more into one of the other girls, they're so much cuter and sweeter and nicer than I have ever been to you, so... I don't ever expect you to think anything like that of me. I guess I just have a hard time <laughs> letting people know how I really feel. And I guess what I'm trying to say is that don't laugh at me, okay? I'm being serious for once. I like you, okay? I really, really like you. I guess uh, we've always just been together as a group and we've never had much time just one-on-one. -on -one. I'm really bad at expressing my emotions, so... I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to make this weird. I don't want you to, you know... Uh, did I just ruin everything? I'm sorry. Uh, uh, you really mean that? <laughs> no way, you... You... Like me, too? No, you, you don't have to say that just because, you know, I went ahead and embarrassed myself confessing that I, you know, like you, so just forget I ever said anything. Really, it's for the best. Are you sure? I would have thought that you would have picked one of the other cuter girls. One of the sweet, cute girls that has a crush on you from our friend group. I mean, you must know that most of the girls that we know do like you, right? <sighs> oh, come on, you can't be that oblivious. Whenever we have girls' nights, all of the single girls are always talking about you. <laughs> are you sure that you like me? Not one of them? <laughs> I mean, I, I never would have guessed. Maybe, perhaps, we're more alike than we think. <laughs> perhaps you're not so good at talking about how you feel either. Hmm. Well, I, I mean, I guess we could both try and work on that together. Uh, I mean, not together, like dating or anything, but I mean, not unless you would like that or... Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm... <sighs> You wouldn't mind? I mean, we can try and go out together and go on a date and see what happens, I guess. <laughs> I mean, that would, that would be amazing. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess we've already... 
I've been cuddling all this time, so we're already kind of at first base. <laughs> Not that uh, I don't want to rush things, you know. Maybe if we make it out of here alive, we'll <laughs> go and see a movie together or something. Or you can just come to my place and we can chill and play some video games or something. I don't know. If you want to, I mean, I I'm not forcing you for anything. Uh, okay. Well, then I guess it's a date. First, we gotta get out of these woods, though. <sighs> well, as long as you're here to keep me nice and warm, we should... Last the night, I think. Uh, I'm so exhausted from, well, just camping, hiking all day, swimming in the lake, and then setting up all the tents and stuff earlier. I wish we had a tent now. But I guess it's also kind of nice to look up and see the stars. We don't ever really get to see them this clearly when we're in town, with all the lights. Look, aren't they just so beautiful? Hmm. You know, despite the almost freezing to death kind of thing, this evening's been kind of nice. And I suppose if I was going to get lost in the woods with anyone, I'm glad it was you. <laughs> hmm. Maybe it was supposed to be, huh? We've never really gotten this much time with just you and I, one-on-one. -on -one. Hmm. Now I guess we know we both feel the same way about each other, so I think everything happens for a reason. And this night, <laughs> this cozy evening together, that is one of those things that was meant to be. At least, I like to think so. You know, when you get past the darkness, the woods at night are really beautiful. The stars overhead. The gentle breeze rustling through the trees. Cuddled up in a soft mossy bed by a tree. <laughs> I can think of worse ways to spend an evening with someone. But, well, I'm glad that someone was you. <sighs> Look, do you see that? Yeah, that's someone's torch. Look, there's a few lights. <laughs> that must be the others come to look for us. Uh, quick, <laughs> get, get off me. We can't let them see us cuddling like this. The other girls will rip my throat out. <laughs> they might be a problem that we have to deal with later. Thank you, again. I guess you're my hero. <laughs> no. I mean, without your body heat, I would, well, probably be really sick by now. Lizards can't go very long without, you know, having some heat. Especially not in cold temperatures like this. 
Come on. Let's go meet up with the others. They're not that far away. And maybe let's just keep this little evening to ourselves for now. And then we can see where we go later, okay? Alright. Come on. Let's go meet up with